wiki.easyvid.com. Search EasyVid Wiki before you decide. EasyVid presents the 10 best capture cards. Let's get started with the list. Starting off our list at number 10. The Magewell HDMI Plus is remarkably easy to use with a simple plug and play installation and a completely lag free pass through port. On top of its simplicity, it's exceptionally reliable, promising not to drop frames or distort audio. It comes with separate mic and headphone jacks, however it downscales USB feeds to 1080p and it's considered quite overpriced. At number 9, with a relatively low price tag and an extremely easy operation, the MyPin 60fps is an excellent way to preserve your opponent's humiliation for posterity's enjoyment. Just three total ports make it simple to document your rise to king of the hill. It's ideal for consoles and transmits via a super speed USB, but there are no audio in or out jacks. Coming in at number 8 in our list, the Elgato 4K60 is a truly top-of-the-line component, capable of archiving at resolutions higher than many computers can even display. It's so incredibly expensive, however, that it's more suited to eSports organizers than the average gamer. It boasts ultra-low latency transmission and is compatible with all PCIe GPUs. However, it is unnecessary for most home setups. Our newest choices can only be seen at wiki.easyvid.com. Go there now and search for Capture Cards, or simply click beneath this video. At number 7, once you've found that box of old VHS tapes in the attic, the PAR recorder will help you digitize them in preparation for conversion, editing and storage. It's awfully simple to use, and it works with virtually anything that has a standard AV output. It saves AVI files direct to an SD card, and is a low-priced and specialized device. It's not suitable for gaming. Moving up our list to number 6. Whether you're trying to record from an old gaming console or a new one, the AGP Tech HD can handle the job. It supports simultaneous HDMI, composite and component connections, and has a remote control to select the desired source. It offers one-button still image captures and allows real-time voice commentary. However, it is limited to a 2GB maximum file size. Halfway up our list at number 5, the Elgato HD60S lets you save your most epic sessions for later review, as well as live stream them straight to the web via the USB 3.0 port, and all in stunning 1080p. It's designed to work with Windows 10 and Mac OS Sierra, or newer. It connects via a USB Type-C and offers on-the-fly screen layout changes, but it lacks a PC-free operation. At number 4, the AVM Media HD2 is intended to bridge the gap between your powerful desktop rig and the exposure of huge platforms like Twitch and YouTube. It lets you set the compression level for each session, enabling lossless archival with a fast enough PC. It supports 60 frames per second capture and includes editing and live overlay tools. Note that it requires an open expansion slot. Nearing the top of our list at number 3, Configured to make multi-source capture simple and easy, the Cloner Box Pro would make a versatile addition to any home theater. With RCA and VGA and component support, it's perfect for archiving decades of family footage. It comes with an integrated H.264 hardware encoder, AV editing software, and an easy-to-use remote control. Our newest choices can only be seen at wiki.easyvid.com. Go there now and search for Capture Cards, or simply click beneath this video. At number 2, the AVA Media 2 Plus is intended for hardcore console streamers who value a razor-sharp image and lightning quick response times. Its instant video pass-through makes it the perfect link between a PS4 Pro and an HDR-ready 4K TV. It comes in a reasonably portable form factor with an integrated microSD slot, and it can record without the use of a PC. And coming in at number one on our list, the Elgato HD60 Pro fills a PCIe slot inside your computer, taking the heat off your CPU when duplicating and recording video. It offers true HD resolution at 60Hz, ensuring a smooth frame rate with minimal motion blur. It features separate audio and video tracks and powerful editing software. It doesn't restrict the internal airflow. Our newest choices can only be seen at wiki.easyvid.com. Go there now and search for Capture Cards, or simply click beneath this video.